Sean X coming at you with another conference tournament preview. The Ohio Valley gets a look this afternoon here. Odds from FanDuel. They could be slightly different. It is what it is, folks. That's what I always say. Shop around. Whether you're coming to, you see the midday money, that's my daily show, live seven days a week. And uh, back up on Wednesday, we'll be doing the, the late night show too. Late night money, we'll be back with conference tournaments and day action. So you got that to look forward to. But right now, let's talk some Ohio Valley. And um, listen, you got three teams here at the top, Moorhead, T. Martin, and Little Rock, all go 14-4 and four in conference play. Moorhead, although the three, technically the three seed, um, they have the shortest odds. Little Rock, the one seed, and then Tennessee Martin. Um, that's the way it goes based on their breakdowns. And we'll jump right into it right here because this is a top-heavy conference with these three and Western Illinois. Um, Southern Indiana, Eastern Illinois, you got no shot here. I mean, you're the seven, eight seeds. I don't see much. Uh, barring a miracle, these guys get to the finals. All right. Um, SIUE. Now, they scored a win over Moorhead. That being said, no thank you. Tennessee State, again. Um, no, you, you might get, you might get past Southern Indiana first round. I say, I mentioned midday money because tune in, we could have a free pick in one of these games. We'll have a preview pick in one of these games. Spreads are different than betting a tournament. Now, Moorhead, again, as I said, the three seed technically, um, even though they're all 14 and four in conference play, but the favored at a plus 115. Now, 14 to 4 in conference, as I said, 23 and 8 overall, not bad. 9 and 7 on the road, which is good because the conference takes place on the road. These are road games. We're not at, we're not at a conference. Um, we're not at campus sites here. These guys play in where we got these games here. Ford Center in Evansville, Indiana. That's what my sheet says where these games take place. As I mentioned, lost at SIUE lost at Little Rock, 69-68. Uh, lows are at T. Martin, 88-82. Um, home loss, Southern Indiana. Uh, that was three straight just a couple weeks ago in mid-February. So, writing this ship a little bit, but you saw a little hiccup here with some losses, and a couple of those losses are to teams you're going to be facing here on a neutral. One was close. One was sort of close. I mean, I'm not going to say six. I mean, six points. You're losing games by six. Or you're, you're, you got it done here. But at a plus 115, do we want to go at basically even money? Is that is that where we want to put our cash at here? Uh, I'm like a little rock here. They are the one seed. Split versus Tennessee Martin, and they beat Moorhead. Nine straight wins coming in. They have the easier bracket, as I mentioned. Tennessee State at South Indiana. Then they get Western Illinois is the four seed who, if it plays out, that's who they will face. That's who they will face. Um, I got an easier spot here, a team playing well, plus 230. I think it's worth a wild shot here. You want to take a little plus 230? I'm not going to say no. Tennessee Martin is a two seed here. They are plus 340. Again, a team that is nine and seven on a road. I mentioned Little Rock. Um, just six and six on the road. So out of the three here who are the top seeds, the other two are nine and seven. But here's the difference here. You have Moorhead as a three seed, no extra rest, and they are the odds on favorite. They had to play an extra game to even get to the championship. So here comes T Martin. You want a 340 spot with a team that's won seven in a row? I don't sure. They lost that little rock, 7957. Um four wins. Then a loss at Moorhead, 84-66. You know, you split versus both of these guys. Now, I mentioned nine in a row for Moorhead. This isn't a bad run when you go 11-2 and two and you lose to um, the one seed and a three seed. The question is, not the question, more of a statement for me is, it's 340 looks nice. But 20-point 
losses on the road, 16 point losses, 18 point loss on the road. Ah, that's why it's a 340 spot here, even though you're the two seed. You get blasted. Now, they're not true road games. It's a neutral. No, thank you. You want to go a little deep. You know, if you don't like Little Rock with me, can I interest you in a little Western Illinois at 9 1? Now, a game off of the leaders here at 13 and 5, right? And as I said, top heavy, top heavy, because the bottom of this here, 5 and 13 teams, the other couple of worst teams, they don't even make the tournament. But 13 to 5 in conference play, close loss at Little Rock, right? I mean, you lose 63 uh, 60, that's not a bad one. And you, you could very well face these guys on that side of the bracket, and you lose by three. Okay, you're in it. I mean, you you, you battle them. I, I don't I don't hate you. Want to take a little um, Western Illinois? Who, by the way, ten and six on the road. You split versus Tennessee Martin. Uh, oh and two versus Moorhead, and you got you know Moorhead got you pretty good, twenty one and fourteen points. But this is with Moorhead again as a three seed. They have to play the winner of Edwardsville and Eastern Illinois. Get past that game, Tennessee Martin, and then you move on to the final. So um, if you want to look at this and think to yourself, well, they played a close one a Little Rock. Maybe they pull out a miracle. Things go right. You never know. It's March Madness. Here comes a Cinderella slipper. Sure. Um, you split versus T. Martin, who is the two seed. And as I mentioned, they, you know, they Tennessee Martin split against. Uh, Morehead, so maybe you don't even get Morehead. Obviously, you know, two bad losses, 21 to 14 points, not good, which is, you know, rolls us back to um, other road losses that we mentioned with uh, Tennessee Martin losing on Morehead and that Little Rock. So those are little things I kind of look at if you want to get into deeper, longer odds or however you want to uh, play the game here. But for me, um, I'm going Little Rock plus the 320. Excuse me, plus 230. Reading it backwards there. Little Rock for me, I will go square chalky one seed at plus 230 for the video here. Uh, hit the like button if you want. Leave a comment. You want to put notification on so you know when I add up all the uh, or add in other conference tournaments. Super. If you're an OVC cat, Please leave a comment. Let me know what your thoughts. You know, you, you you're you're more tuned in. You might think something's a better angle. Please tune into the live show on game day. Let's find some winners. I appreciate you spending uh, eight minutes of your life with me. Good luck.